Okay, so Hawkmoth, a complete and total idiot. How does that play out? Oh, it's very simple. It's very simple. Let me check something out. Make sure that I didn't do anything wrong. Hmm. Okay, well, hopefully it'll be cool now. Anyways, Hawkmoth now has all the miraculouses except for two. Well, three, technically, except for three. <laughs> Yeah, he doesn't care about the Miraculouses, and it kind of sucks too, where it's like, and when he recover all the Miraculouses and even take one from Hawkmoth, lo and behold, the Peacock Miraculous, what the hell. And note, we know that there's a future Hawkmoth, so that means even if they get all the Miraculouses, he doesn't get to keep his. Eventually, it gets to the point where it gets passed to someone else. And it's like, huh. And who knows what that someone else is capable of, or why. The future Hawkmoth, we have no idea what they want to wish for. Who knows, it just basically might be out of gl not gloom and doom. Not even wanting to get someone back in their lives. We don't know. So, thanks to one person who gave me a tip, which if they're watching, hey. The thing is, is this, is that apparently every single episode of Season 5 is basically named after a Miraculous. My thought is either A, he's gonna make a Sinti monster and give the Sinti monster the miraculous and go with it until the point of where, well, every single episode he loses it because, well, he decided to just, you know. <laughs> or it could happen like this where he akumatizes someone, gives someone the miraculous, and then there we go. Or they triple powers him or something. But either way, it's like, I'm pretty sure he's a dumb idiot and he just allows the Miraculous to get lost one by one. I'm pretty sure that's how it's going to go. He's a dumb moron. He's a complete stupid moron. And he doesn't even know how the wish even goes. It's like, oh, the crazy part would be this. If Zaz actually talks to Hawkmoth and shows him what he saw... Maybe that'll actually snap him out. <laughs> That's the funniest part. It's like, if Zaz can actually show him what happens every single time, or Zaz is able to talk to him, oh boy, I wonder how that's going to play out. It's going to be very, very funny, where it's like, ooh, he, and maybe Hawkmoth is going to be a complete idiot and say, no, you're wrong. Gabriel's like, no, you're wrong. That's not how it goes. You can't r recall anything. <laughs> it's like, yeah, um... Dude, he's a Kwame who's seen lots and lots of destruction, especially like at least two or three things that you did. So, good idea to listen to him. And maybe that's how he gets destroyed, but I doubt it. Either way, pretty sure he's going to be an idiot moron and loses the, all the miraculouses one by one by simply just allowing them to be dangled away. Instead of something clever, much more smarter. I'm pretty sure he's going to be an idiot and he's going to just lose him. <laughs> That's how it's going to go. The only one's the part is to be, again, the Peacock Miraculous is technically in the wind. So I really hope that they'll tell the Guardian and the Guardian goes to Felix and takes it back. So at least the good news is that he got no other Miraculous. And the only one's missing is, of course, the Butterfly Miraculous, which is like... Oh boy, because the future has to happen some way, shape, or form, right? So we have to see how that plays out. And who knows? Well, actually, no, we can't say who knows. Apparently, if we really go by looking at this, I don't think Ladybug was the guardian in the future. I don't think she was. I kind of don't think so. So we have to see how that plays out too. Because it's like if she wasn't a guardian, then that means the guardian guardian or the monk guard monk that wants to become a guardian will become the guardian. So then there we go. Or something else entirely. I'm kind of leaning towards the part of what if they actually did the same thing that Marinette did. She they chose someone for the butterfly miraculous, and oops, turns out that they weren't to be trusted. The only messed up part is that. Well, how in the world do you know who it is? It's like, you should know who it is then. The Guardian should know who it is, and it shouldn't be like, oh, I can't tell you. Dude, what? <laughs> oh, so, we'll just have to see how that plays out. But still, I most likely have to say, if this is the final season, 
Hawkmoth is going to be a total idiot, and he's going to be backstabbed, most likely by Lila. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, because look at Lila's face at the end of the episode of the season four. She was delighted when, uh, shoot, it's not Nicole, right? No, it's not Nicole. Anyways, uh, Gabriel's assistant. <laughs> When she actually was having issues and she was coughing and she's on the floor, look at Lila smiling deviously. It's like, okay, what's your play? Are you trying to become his new secretary and then weasel your way into something else? And thus she takes the butterfly miraculous. And like I figured, she's the future hog moth. While the old hog moth, I don't know, will she take him down too? <laughs> will he? she strike him down too? Or even funnier, she puts him under my control and now she's he is under her command. Ooh. <laughs> like, yeah, that's a good point of where it's like, I don't know. We'll just have to see how that plays out.